Sup nerds, today we have Numamon versus Lugamon. Brandon starts us off by hatching Baumon and playing AG for 3. Chris hatches Sunamon, he was an Agumon. Plays Cool Boy for 2, scratches top 3. Nume X, arguably the best card in the deck, feels good. And then plays Numamon for 3. And we have a chat here. Uh, Brandon should go to 3 from AG, the beginning of his main phase. He plays Hell. For seven, deletes himself in a turn, draws two, and discards Fang to blow up the Numamon. And then Chris's turn at five. He promotes Agu. Chris plays Nume X for three. All right, and then swing on him one K dies. Plays Monze for seven, triggers his effect, tucks Nume to gain some memory. Alright, Brandon started main phase, gains one memory from AJ to go to four, plays Analog, scratches top three, adds Lugamon, Evo's into Lugamon. Plays Wisdom, scratches top two, adds Tyranno. Plays another Wisdom, adds Black Gato. And then Chris's turn at two, he hatches Suno, Evo's into Agu. Evo's into Monza X for zero memory, taps Cool Boy, draws another card, gains memory, triggers Monza X effect, plays Numamon. Evo's into Nume X for zero. Plays Satsuki for three, and then Mind Links with the Monza X. He ripped it off the Nume X, unfortunately. Swing on him, two checks of jamming. Checks an analog. Brandon adds Fangmon, trashes the rest. Second check, he is good. And then Swing on him, 2k. Dies. And he goes into Platinum for 3 memory, triggers Platinum's effect. Trash his Nume, gains 2 memory. And that chokes Brandon to 1, and he reboots. Brandon promotes, gains memory from AG. And that Platinum does have Blocker, and so does the Nume X, actually. Alright, Brandon pops Wisdom. Eva's in a Fang for 0. Mind Link's AG. Swing security, triggers Fangmon, picks up Soul with Fangmon's effect, trashes and then triggers Bow to Evo into Soul for 3 memory, triggers Soul's effect, plays Fang, triggers Fang's effect, adds Hell, and then he has to discard from Fang's effect, trashes Black Auto and then Alliances, so 12k, 2 checks. Chris blocks with Platinum. On deletion, gets to play a Monze from hand, triggers Monze's effect, tucks Nume, gains two memory, and then end of attack, Brandon gains one memory, and then Chris targets the soul with the minus 3k, minus one security, end of turn, unmind link, Chris's turn at two, he promotes, and we have another chat here, uh, Chris should gain one memory from that Agumon. Swing security and swings for game. So Nume does take game one. By the way, if you guys enjoy this type of content, please like and subscribe. It really helps support the channel. And if you're interested in a Numamon deck profile, link will be in the pinned comment below. And if you're interested in a Lugamon deck profile, link will be in the pinned comment below as well. All right, so Brandon chooses to go first for game two. Hatches Balmon. Eva's in a Luga. Plays Wisdom. Scourges. Adds Finn. Chris hatches Tokomon. Evo's into Uko, plays Garamon for three, trashes Platinum to draw two cards. Brandon promotes, triggers his effect, tucks AG, gains memory. Plays Tyranno for four, scourges top four, adds Soul, now has to discard a card. Discards Black Gato, and then Chris's turn at two, he promotes Uko, gains memory and hatches. Evo's another Uko. Plays Gary for three, trashes another platinum, draws two. Swing on him 2k, Brandon blocks with Tyranno. Swing on him 2k, Brandon blocks with Lugamon. Chris definitely forgot that Tyrannomon has blocker, which I've forgotten that before, just because it's so random. Chris activates Cool Boy, scratches top three, no targets. Didn't really need any of those cards anyway. Brandon hatches Baumon, he was in a Luga. Plays Analog Youth, scratches top three, adds Chimera, trashes the rest. Right, Brandon Hardy goes in a Chimera for four, triggers its effect. 
Tux Lugamon minus his 3k on both of Chris's Digimon, killing both of them. Tokomon on deletion, Chris draws a card. And then Chris's turn at 4. Promotes, gains memory hatches from Uko. He goes into Agu. Alright, Chris plays Monze for 7, triggers effect, Tux Garamon, gains memory, minus his 3k, and one security check on the Chimeramon until the end of Brandon's turn. And Eva's into Numamon and raising for two, and Brandon's turn at two. He promotes, triggers Lugamon's effect, Tux AG from trash to gain a memory. Pops Wisdom. Eva's into Fang for two memory, triggers Fang's effect. Plays Tyranno, triggers Tyrannomon effect. Adds Lugarmon, has to discard a card. And then gains a memory from the Finn Inheritable. Alright, Brandon swings for no security checks, deletes the Monze to unsuspend. And he was in a ruin mode, minus his 5k on Chris's board until the end of his turn. And unmind links the AG. Chris's turn at 3, that's pretty rough. Ruin mode's a good card. Alright, and Chris Death X for 5 memory, Devos Brandon's board, and blows up all level 4 lowers, sets Brandon to 2. Brandon gains a memory after hatching for Balmon. Plays Fang for 4 memory, and then gains a memory after adding and trashing a card. Eva's in a Lugamon and Raising. Plays Wisdom, Scourge's top 2. Adds the Hell, and then end of turn, the Fang gets blown up. Chris promotes. Yeah, Chris has drawn a lot of cards, but they're like all of his Agumons and just a bunch of weird cards. Alright, Chris swings security, survives. Plays Agu X, Scourge's top three, adds Nume X. And then Brandon's turn at two, he promotes, gains memory from AG, triggers Lugamon's effect, tucks AG from trash to gain another memory, goes to four. This is going to be pretty rough. Pops Wisdom, Eva's in a Lugar for zero, Pops Wisdom, Eva's in a Soul for one, triggers Soul's effect, plays Tyranno, triggers Tyranno effect, Scorch's top four, max value, adds Hell and AG, has to discard a card, and then gains three memory from his Inheritables, goes to six, Swing Security, triggers Soul, gains memory, trashes a card, Evo's into Finn off the Balmon effect, triggers Finn's effect, plays a bunch of dudes, and Chris scoops. So we're going to go to game three. All right, Chris chooses to go first for game three, hatches Sunamon, Evo's into Ukomon. If you guys are wondering why Chris scooped game two, he plays no bombs in his list, so that was definitely going to be just an OTK. And then he plays Ukomon to give Brandon three. So Brandon hatches Balmon, Evo's into Luga for zero. Plays Hell for seven... Triggers end of turn to draw two first. After deleting himself and then discard two cards, blows up the Uko. Chris's turn at four. Promotes, hatches, and gains memory. Eva's an Agu X. Plays Cool Boy for two. Scratches top three. Monzi X, let's go. Plays Nume for three, no effect. Eva's an Nume X for zero. Triggers. Sunamon to draw, triggers Cool Boy to draw, and gain a memory. Goes back to 1. Swing on him 2k. Triggers Protoform. Evo's into Monzi X for 2 memory. Tucks the Protoform, triggers Monzi X effect. Plays Garamon, triggers Garamon effect, trashes Nume X to draw 2. And then Brandon's turn at 1 memory. He promotes. Alright, he swings security, triggers Lugamon effect, trashes Lugar to blow up the Garamon, and then triggers Baumon's effect. Eva's in a Lugar for zero, triggers Lugar's wind digivolving, trashes Soul to give him 2000 DP, triggers Baumon again to Evo into Soul, and then triggers Soul's effect here. Just kidding, no targets. And then it's 10k for one check, and Chris does have blocker on his Monzi X. Chris lets it through, and then end of attack, Brandon gains 2 memory, and then Chris's turn at 2. 
He promotes Agu X. Alright, Chris Eva is into Nume for three. Triggers Nume's effect. Trashes Nume, gains two memory. And we have a Chet here. Um, he should draw an extra card off that Sunamon underneath Agu X. Swings over the Soul for 9k. And then plays Nume for three to give Brandon two. Brandon hatches Balmon, Eva's into Lugamon. Plays Wisdom, Scourge's top two, adds the Soul. And then plays Fang, triggers Fang. Picks up Lugar, and then has to discard a card. Discards Finn, and then Chris's turn at four, he hatches Tokomon. Eva's into Nume X, triggers Sunamon to draw, triggers Cool Boy to draw and gain one. Eva's into Uko and Raising. Eva's into Warumon Zimon for three memory. Triggers his effect to ditch a Platinum to, air quotes, the Eva the Fang, just to get the Platinum in trash. Eva's in Monzi X for zero, triggers Monzi X effect. Plays Nimamon for zero, triggers Monzi X to minus 8k on the Fang. Eva's into Nume X. Swang on him, two checks, 8k. Survives. Swang on him, 3k. Survives. Oh, wow. Yeah, Chris just assumed that was going to die, but it did not. And he was in room mode for 5, minus his 5k on Brandon's field until the end of his turn. Offers handshake, lol. Brandon goes to 5 at the beginning of main phase from double AG. Brandon does concede, so Nume does take the match 2-1, but I appreciate you guys stopping by. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy seeing this kind of content want to come back for more. But until next time, see ya.